Obi-Wan Lewis here and I thought I'd bring some recent news relating to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. This week, Niantic has announced a lot of things. For one, this coming weekend, we are getting a limited research for Meryl. And if you're lucky, you might get a shiny, which is green. And of course, also announced that we're getting close to completing a challenge which will give us shiny Galarian Ponyta in the Pokemon Go, which of course you can also transfer it into Pokemon Sword and Sword or Shield using Pokemon Home. In other Pokemon news, I forgot to say this, but last week New Pokemon Snap is now out for the Nintendo Switch. And if I get the game, I'll be sure to review it here on this channel. From what I heard from YouTubers such as Reversal, Zoe Two Dots, and others, shiny Pokemon do not exist. But, from what I heard, New Pokemon Snap is a very good title to have for the Switch. It is a long overdue sequel to the original Pokemon Snap from 2000. Over 21 years ago, which brings back memories of when I played the game at the age of 16. I can't wait to explore the region that this game has to offer, including being underwater, which is something I like to do, especially when scuba diving. It makes me think about scuba diving. And of course, Xerneas and the Luminous X event are also now live in Pokemon Go as well. And of course, Xerneas is a level 5 raid boss, which of course, it is a fairy type. It'll, it'll take 5 or more trainers to defeat, since it's a level 5 raid boss. And you have to work together. I suggest using Steel and Poison type Pokemon if you're going to take on fairy types like Xerneas. And speaking of fairy types, Swirlix as well as Spritzy and their evolutions and of course Gumi and its evolutions are now also available in Pokemon Go. To get Gumi's final evolution, Goomdra, you have to evolve its middle stage Slidgoo when it's either raining or with a rainy module which of course you can also buy in the in-game store or you get one for completing the Luminous X event and during this event you not only get to catch fairy types but also dragon type Pokemon as well especially if you're trying to complete your fairy and dragon type medals whether you're going for the gold or even the platinum medals as part of the requirements one more thing next week I'll definitely be making my video about Swablu Community Day and I'm excited for that video and I might do a video on the Merrill Research Day as well. Stay tuned, everyone. Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure. Also, during these times, when heading out, wear a mask, practice social distancing, Carry hand sanitizer, wash your hands, stay away from large crowds, get vaccinated, and lastly, stay safe, stay healthy, and together we will get through these dark times together.